Hi, my name is Sal. Thanks for clicking this video. So in this video, I'm going to be talking about my moisturizing routine and how I retain moisture longer, the products I use, and yeah, basically how I moisturize my hair and keep my hair moisturized. I started doing something different to my moisturizing routine and um, to be honest, it's kept my hair really moisturized. So um, my hair has been in this style. It's just like a little bun. For the whole week for seven days straight so i wash my hair as sunday today is last week sunday and i put it in this style went through the week with this style i haven't taken it down i didn't take it down or like i haven't done anything to it and like i feel you know how you can feel your hair is like really dry and crunchy like this feels so so moisturized. I mean, I can't think of anything else that I changed in my routine that has made my hair like really moisturized. It's just this one technique that I incorporated into my routine that's made it so. This is my first takedown in weeks. I haven't detangled my hair throughout the seven days. I haven't re-moisturized. I've done nothing to it all through the week i usually like moisturize my hair in the middle of the week so i wash it on sunday so i'll mo re-moisturize it on wednesday but i felt my hair and it didn't need any moisture and sometimes too much moisture is what's killing your hair so i just let it be and right now it's i can feel it's a little bit dry but not too dry that you would think that I went through the week without much stress in my hair. Um, if I was lazy, <laughs> I'll probably like go another week without moisturizing my hair, and I think my hair would be fine. Like that's how much moisture I retained in my hair just by doing one thing differently. So. I'm just gonna take down my hair. Okay. So, whew, my scalp can breathe. And like throughout the week, I've been, I'm not one to use gel, but with this style, I just wanted it to be slicked down. So I just like use a little bit of gel and apply it on like the edges and I, I think I did that like twice during the week and you know how gel is like drying to your hair and all of that this wasn't like that um yeah it still kept my hair moisturized I'm like oh, I need to keep doing this thing <laughs> um oh before I forget Thank you so, so, so much for subscribing to my channel. If you've subscribed, I thank you so much. I'm so grateful to you. And it kind of, it motivates me to put out content, like to make videos. And um, I just want to say thank you so much to everyone that has subscribed to my channel. And um, I mean, it was just like a couple months ago, I had 60 subscribers and i was like oh my god i was so excited i was like 60 people watch my videos oh no 60 people actually subscribe to my um channel and then fast forward i look again it's like over 600 like what i'm speechless but um thank you so much for subscribing to my channel and if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet please do it helps a lot like i said it kind of it motivates me to Put out content and i hope you know you get some tips here and there from my um videos so yes back into the video so i'm just gonna finger detangle a bit and my goal here is not to detangle my hair it's just to like re-moisturize it because i'm not washing it or anything i'm i'm gonna re-moisturize it and then style it for next week and then wash my hair next week because I wash my hair every two weeks. I mean, I don't know what my scalp is looking like, but it feels okay. So I'm just going to massage it. And 
and I'm just gonna do um, maybe four or six sections depends um, okay so this is one section this is the other and I'm just gonna um, put this away part it into two as well like two well not exactly equal but yeah and then put this away okay now we have this section to work with so before I start I'm just gonna show you the products that I'm going to use first up is my water in the spray bottle my leave-in conditioner I'm using the Cantu Argan oil leave-in conditioner repair cream I've always used the shea butter one but this is my first time using the Argan um, oil leave-in conditioner so we'll see um, how I like it if you've used the Argan oil before let me know what you think about it in the comments section um, it smells good shea butter mix is also a hair treatment for damaged hair and um to keep your hair moisturized this is the secret you know how you act like natural girls like what's your secret what's your secret this is my secret <laughs> one of the techniques that i started doing is using warm water not room temperature water or cold water so warm water like opens up your cuticles and that helps you absorb like it helps your hair absorb whatever you put after it so if you put in the leave-in conditioner after the water like it opens up your cuticles to let the um let your hair absorb it much more I'm like seeing some shed hair and it's like totally normal to have um, your hair shedding because I haven't detangled in a week so um, totally normal make sure that every strand oops tangle every strand is like covered and I work the water in the hair making sure it's absorbed like i said shedding totally normal <laughs> so i just keep adding to like i kind of feel like my hair is moisturized all the way And it has absorbed every sprinkle of the water. And I think we are good. So the um, technique that I use to moisturize my hair is mostly the LCO method. So liquid, cream, and oils, which is so L, my liquid, is going to be this warm water here and my cream is going to be my leave-in conditioner, my can to leave-in conditioner and my O is going to be my hair treatment with this shea butter mix with um, different oils in it. So that's what I use. I use the LCO method. But sometimes, um, for some reason, I use the L-O-C-O -O method. So after putting water, I follow up with oil and then the leave-in conditioner and then oil again but today and what i did last week i'm just going to repeat it because it kept my hair really moisturized so i'm just going to do the lco method so i just put in my warm water my l following up with my cream which is my cantu leave-in conditioner and this is what it looks like see it has a creamy texture um yeah and it smells super good so this is how much i'm going to put in there and just follow it up with the water and as you're doing that you're you're going to continue to finger detangle and you see that you get some more shed hair 
and it's totally normal to have shit hair. So I focus on my ends a lot because that's like the oldest part of your hair. Um, and you know, um, because it's the oldest part, you want to take like pay extra attention to it. That's why I focus on my ends the most, but just make sure that all the strands are covered and um, absorb the leave-in conditioner. Okay, so it's all moisturized and I'm just going to follow up with my O, which is the oil. And this is my oil I'm going to use. So I have a hair stuck to my finger. So this much, actually, I love the consistency of this oil. It's like, it's not too light for my hair and it's not too thick. It's like the perfect medium. And this is what it looks like after I rub it through my hands and it still smells so good. <laughs> I had this, um, my product on sale um i sell them online i don't have a website for them yet but that's um in the work so once i have my website up i'm definitely gonna let you guys know how to get your hands on this because i've been using it throughout my natural hair journey and um it has never failed so it's like why not share it with um, everyone out there so yeah so you guys will be informed once the website is up so just um look forward to that announcement <laughs> I hope you guys I wish you guys could feel it <laughs> but it's super super duper moisturized and I'm just gonna twist it and um, do the same thing all around my hair And as I'm twisting, sometimes I feel like it's not like moisturized enough. I would like, you know, you can always like go in and apply more if you want, but I feel that it's super moisturized. I just got a little bit more of the oil and I'm just going to put it on the ends. Because it's the oldest part and you have to really take care of that because that's how you retain length without the oldest part of your hair your hair is just gonna keep breaking and getting shorter okay so I'm done with this and um, I have another technique that I'm gonna show you at the end so I'm just going to do all of this off camera I'm just gonna do the same thing I did with this to all of this off camera and then um, I'll come back and let you know. After I'm moisturized and I just put a plastic um, cap or a plastic bag over my hair to trap in more moisture. And that's what does the trick guys. So this is what my hair is looking like. I'm just gonna unravel it so you can see how moisturized my hair is. 